Cancer, welcome to Saturated in Love, where we dive deep into the vibration of love. If you're new, please click subscribe so you don't miss a video, especially if you like the content here today. I want to thank everyone for your likes, comments, subscribes, and shares that helped me reach 20k subs. I'm telling the world in every intro, I'm trying to get to 100, so hook your girl up. I do love you guys, okay? I'll be here for the next 10 years bothering you, and even if you unsubscribe, unfollow, I promise one day I'll pop up on that timeline oh dear collective look at me talking crap okay cancer the archetype of an individual you might be dealing with sorry i'm so strange but not sorry fire signs aries leo sagittarius also cancer you're feeling passionate you're burning and churning and yearning for a crush perhaps somebody well built <laughs> a la fitness evolution and training hey como esta ustedes suck by say yes and one more chrome we have an older woman, perhaps, a wise soul here, okay? So somebody who's feeling passionate, somebody's got a crush. We have somebody who's full of wisdom as well, so you're not gonna let your desires get out of hand, are we? Are we, Cancer? Oh, there, Cancer, let's see what else is happening here. What's your energy towards your person? Thank you, Holy Spirit. What's Cancer's energy towards their person? The sun in the reverse. Four of swords in the reverse. Somebody's not too happy. Oh my God, eight of cups upright. Somebody's not too happy that uh, it seems like someone has walked away from a connection. Okay, somebody stopped dead in their tracks. Six of wands. It's like you had all the attention. You felt success. But then somebody decided to take a trip and move from this connection. Page of Cups in the reverse. They just stopped talking to you. There was deception here. This person was not being upfront with you. It's like they've gone into hiding, okay? What's the T on this individual that Dear Cancer may be dealing with that fled? It says desk. Pay attention to your work. Your person could have gone off to pay attention to their work tower. It says solid foundation, success with effort. Your person is building a, a, a foundation for themselves. Your person is building a business. Your person is building something great, grand. They might not be able to be in a love relationship right now. There's somebody who's non-committal cancer that you're dealing with and it's because they're paying attention to their work, okay? They deceived you into thinking that, you know, they wanted something more steady, right? There's lots of passion between you, though. Don't get it twisted, okay? If you're an old soul, I feel like you don't want just for it to be a romp in the sack. You were hoping that this person would be yours. But this crush of yours, this young guy, this hot boy, he's got plans, all right? He's trying to build a successful and stable foundation of work ethic and abundance for himself, as well as dog is here. It says protection from a powerful friend. What I will say is that I think this individual, again, the deception here is only that the person needs to build themselves, okay? So whether it's a financial effort, whether it is a educational effort, this person is off minding their own business. Quite literally, somebody is minding their business. So Cancer, it might be time for you to mind yours. Amen. Thank you, Holy Spirit. What is dear Cancer's person's energy towards them? Two of cups. You see this? They do want love. Okay, in terms of a partner, someone, a companion, someone to see from time to time, someone to deal with, sure. But do they want it to be, and they also want to communicate with you. They do want to still talk to you, okay? But you made it out to seem like you wanted it to be way more serious. Eight of Pentacles, here we go. See, you are working, that's your person's intent, to talk and to have fun together, okay? To get together, to have sex from time to time. I'm keeping it real. Two of Cups, Eight of Wands. Let's get, this is booty call action right here, okay? This person wants to get together from time to time. Sure, your side of things was more like store you away for a rainy day. You know what I'm saying? Uh, keep you here. Keep you home. 
Mm -mm. But you have death here in the reverse. This will not be transformed into the new beginning you were dreaming of. Okay, my God. That's my God. Arrows of love for their cancer who might be dealing with somebody who feels as though they need to build success for them. And right now, a relationship is not the success, but it doesn't mean this person doesn't want to talk to you, okay? They could have stopped talking to you because you put the ultimatum in, well, all or nothing. You know what I'm saying? You're like, love me or leave me alone, <laughs> pretty much. Freak it. You know what I'm saying? I've been showing the other signs of my shirt, so... Love me and leave me alone, y'all. I hope you guys support, okay? Y'all see it on YouTube. It's on Teespring. If you guys just want to Google saturated and love on Teespring. But I do love you guys so much. And the arrows of love says fool's gold. Ooh, cancer. You might be investing too much, okay, into somebody who, again, definitely likes you, definitely is feeling you, feeling the partnership in terms of, Spicy, sexy communication, someone to get to know, sure. But it's foolish of you, okay? Oh, my God. See, my days are cold without you, but I'm hurting while I'm with you. And though my heart can take no more, I just keep running back to you. I'm sorry, I can't sing, but I love to. So, Cancer, I feel like fool's gold if you invest any more into this person, okay? Thinking you about to get a dope ass return on your investment in terms of longevity, think again, okay? Because this person is out again, successfully building a, a tower of abundance for themselves, okay? A different form of tower than you're used to, right? Your tower moment is being faced with the fact that this person does not want to commit right now. That might be a problem for your nurturing, loving self, dear cancer. I get it. You want to hold on, hang on to your love. Matter of fact, your last reading was hang on to your love. So I get it. You know what I'm saying? But this individual definitely has things to do. But the good news is this person is not like... This person is not walking away from you forever, right? This person just is too busy to pin down. That's all it is, okay? But you are protected from a powerful friend. Who's powerful? Your person. This one who's building the solid foundation. This person who's putting in effort for success. This person who's paying attention to their work. This is the person that is gonna be able to protect you, okay? When they come up, it's a come up for you, okay? They're not leaving you in the dust completely, all right? This is their intention towards dear cancer. But again, spirit is pointing you in the direction to notice when you're putting too much into something, all right? Too much expectation leads into disappointment. So you were led into this reading, dear cancer, just to know your friend is about you. Your friend likes you. They may even love you, but they love their dream more. They love themselves right now, and they have a vision, okay? And a mission, and it's all good, baby, baby. Oh, dear cancer. <laughs> Your fortune for the coming week is lion. It says, harness the loyal and protective aura of the lion and charge ahead magnificently. See, you are protected. Does this person want to deal with you romantically? Yes, okay. Is this person a real friend? Yes, okay. Is everything gonna be all right? Yes, okay. So don't worry if this person doesn't sleep over two, three, four nights consecutive. I mean, don't worry if they don't want to move in yet. Don't worry. Who needed to hear this? Dear Cancer, you guys are building progressively with progressive people. Harrow. Slow but sure, okay? This is your wild offering. Holy Spirit, what would you like Dear Cancer to know? It could be about anything at all. Wild offering for Dear Cancer. You're a wise old soul, my dear crone. Man or woman, okay? You are wise you know when it's real and when it ain't somebody could be busy but could still be about you okay <clears throat> this is not the busy fool who's who's just um being a selfish coward and coming around whenever they please and then leaving okay this is somebody who legitimately just has more to do outside of you right now <laughs> all right travel. Oh, they cancer. It says, let every aspect of this trip unfold in harmony. May divine order arrange and handle every detail. I'll be guided easily and follow the leads as they are shown. Who is going on a trip? Travel is indicated, okay? This person is likely going away with you, all right? So enjoy. Enjoy each other's company. Keep it light. Keep it cute. 
All right, don't worry about somebody being non-committal is why you were led to this reading. What is the romance angels advice for those in union? For those in union, we have the black romance cards up in here. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Woo, Lord. And I still can't shuffle them. <laughs> Thank you, Holy Spirit. All right. Ooh, what did I say? This is definitely, I know you guys have a lot of intimacy. <laughs> sexual healing. And it says sexual energy can be used to reconnect. Who do you need to reconnect to? Okay, is it your crush? The one that you're burning and churning and yearning for? Oh, Zig, Hansa. Have fun, all right? And be blessed. Peace.